Thank you for joining our Google Classroom tutorial. Google Classroom is the application that teachers will use primarily to communicate with your children. Here they will stream announcements, important messages, live videos, recorded videos, Zoom links or Google Meet links, and any other pertinent information that you need. Your child can simply ask questions to and from and see due dates for assignments. All teachers in the Scranton School District will have a Google Classroom created and will invite your children. To access the Google Classroom, one way is through the Clever Portal. Once you're signed on, you can simply click on the green chalkboard icon with the silhouette in the center. This will prompt you, if you've not signed in before, to confirm your username and password. The username and password for Google Classroom is the same as Clever. Reverse initials, seven digit code, at ssdedu.org and the temporary password is ssdgoogle which you will be prompted to change. It's important that when you change your child's username and password that you write it down and put it in a safe place. Please discuss with your children the importance of keeping their passwords private. In the event the Clever Portal is down, the other way you can access Google Classroom is going to classroom.google.com. This is also an application that you can download on your phone. Once you go to classroom.google.com, you'll be prompted to enter which account you want to use. If your entire family has Gmail accounts, it's important that you pay attention to which account you're signed on to. If you have multiple children in the district, it's very easy to switch between accounts. I will sign on to my school account. When you first log on to your child's account, you will see classrooms listed on the page. As you can see, Mrs. Tulaney's classroom, I am invited to. You will need to accept that classroom in order to join. Once you click accept, it will take you directly into the classroom. The classroom is where you will see messages posted and classwork that can be assigned. The two tabs that you will primarily use are stream and classwork, switching back and forth. Some teachers will post topics on the side and let you know, Monday's work, Tuesday's work, Wednesday work, or they may switch between subject areas. To get back to the stream, you simply click stream. There is a little box on the left side that shows you if there are assignments that have deadlines or due dates, they will be posted. If you have a question, it's easy to communicate with the teacher and type a message to her. For him. To switch out of this classroom, these three lines right here take you to the main menu and you can switch between all of your teacher's classrooms this way. This is on a computer. If you are using a tablet or phone, it does appear differently. If you would like to switch between accounts, simply Click on the circle icon, and again, on a computer, it's on the right-hand corner. If you're using a phone or a tablet, it will be on the left-hand side. Hold your mouse over that icon and click on the account you want to switch to. Enter your password. Sign on. You can switch back and forth through each child's account and classrooms. If you have any other questions regarding signing on to Google Classroom, please email your child's teacher. Thank you and have a good day.